All right, hello once again, Jeff Scott, Information Technology Instructor at Rankin Technical College, welcoming you back to our Scratch programming class. And in the last program, I was wondering why my program wasn't working, and it was working. So it's going to be a little loud. So let me start the program all over again. So I'm going to come here for the for the um, elephant. So. And let's so you can hear the elephant says ouch. So let me stop it and start it again. And let's do the monkey here. So you can see that that's stopping the monkey, but it's not uh, But you so you can see that happening, but for whatever reason it's not letting the monkey leave after that. And I don't know why. But I was able to come in here and show you All right, what happened when it was touching this? Let's just quickly finish this up, and I'm going to put a cheat in here. So, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to do one last file, save now, and then I'm going to do a file, save as a copy. All right, and this copy. I'm going to call this cheat. So file, whoops, file, save now. And I'm going to make it cheat. All right. And let's see if we can do this. Um, so when we are moving... What if we change this to, and I'm just going to do the up and down, the, I'll do the up and down arrow only here. So there, the, there they are. So I'm going to see if I can make a cheat version. I'm going to grab this touching maze. And I'm going to try to replace that with an AND statement. So if touching maze AND, um, let's put a NOT operator in here. And I'm going to have And we'll use the letter C for cheat. All right. So I'm going to duplicate, just grab, well, not that one. Duplicate here. Do that either. You can duplicate here. There we go. Sometimes it's easier not doing it this way, so. So 
So this is the I don't even know if this is correct, so but we're gonna try it anyway. So here we've got touching maze. I'm gonna do the same kind of thing here. So I'm going to get myself a green and a condition. Touching maze will be here. Let's grab a knot. So I don't know if I did it or not, but let's try this. So file, save now, because this is the cheat, remember? So this was, sorry about that, this was for the monkey. And I want to see now if I can go straight up. traps that are straight up so try it one more time I think it's because I made the cheat one way and I didn't make it the other. So in other words, let me stop this. And let me come in here and uh, so stop. Grab that. Duplicate it. So I'm going to move that down here. So what we have here is we have the down arrow and the up arrow, but we don't have the left and the right. So, we're coming in here and I'm going to change this block right here to this block. And that should do the right arrow and then I'm going to do the same kind of thing here. So I'm going to duplicate that. Come on, all right. 
and I'll just manually change it then. Two knots here, so something is screwed up. All right, and I don't know if I fixed it or not. I don't know if I made it better or made it worse, but let's do a file save now. Let's run it again and see if my X is, or my monkey is now fixed. Okay. I looked it up. Okay. I'm going to have to go back and manually change this in a minute. Alright, so I had to attend to some business for a bit, but I'm back, and just so you know, the I put a cheat in here, and I'll show you quickly what it is. If you hold down on the letter C, the monkey, I'm going to let the traps disappear. Oops. Oh, isn't that funny? Just worked fine. And something else. Hold down on the letter C. I should uh, now. I can't. But I was able to drag it up. One thing I noticed, and this is a error in the code, but if I hold down on the mouse key, well, I was able to drag it then too. <clears throat> so let's try this. Let's when I when it worked, it worked in a smaller window. So let's see if that matters at all. So down with the letter C. And then, <clears throat> and I'd have to make similar change, which I will do to the elephant. Alright. So I and I don't have to use the same key, for example. So I'm gonna duplicate that. Can I do this? There. All right, so looks to me like this should be going in here. put this one in here and that's it this there's a lot of correct code in here but there's a few things that are misplaced as far as where they are Instance, I believe oh, 
crud. I'll go look at that placement in just a minute, but I think checking for the trap on should come near the bottom. In fact, I'm already doing it. There you go. So let's look here. Again, when you keep pulling stuff around like I'm doing here, sooner or later you're going to do something you didn't mean to do. All right. If the right arrow is pressed, change it by 5. But if it's touching the maze and it's not the letter C, move it back. Good. All right. The left arrow is pressed, so this is not right. All right, so. Okay, so let's check this again. All right, right arrow is pressed, change it, put it in the inside to see if you have to reverse or not. So as long as it's not a C, you reverse it. Good. Left arrow pressed. You make the same check. And if this is the case, you change it by a positive 5. Okay. So this if ends here, this if ends here, good. This if ends here, this if ends here. Okay, here's another if. That's good. because there's a lot of code here. <clears throat> so let's check and see what, what, what is here. <clears throat> sorry about that. Crack my knuckles here, sorry. All right, right arrow press, boom, check it. There, we're done. Good. Left arrow press, there, check it, we're done. Good. So we did right arrow, we did left arrow. Down arrow. Press, check it. Good. Up arrow. That looks good. Now we've got here left arrow and up arrow, which I think I've already put in here. There's left arrow, and there's up arrow. So I don't know what the hey this is doing, all this is doing in here. Okay. 
and up arrow has already been done. Down arrow, to my knowledge, has already been done. So we'll check this again. All right. This. All righty. That is all correct. So we've got right arrow, left arrow, down arrow, and up arrow. Then we're checking. All right. So let's, again, let's do a file and let's save everything and run it one last time. Okay, that was the monkey. So that works. If you get trapped like this, and after it stops, You'll touch for two seconds, and then I'm going to move you to a random spot on the screen. Okay, so I guess it's even possible you could go from one trap to another trap, but that's okay. Let's see. Well, this is wrong, and you can see that. These are all colors, everything is coming off. So. This one is still fun. just working it's working fine now what I want to do is I'm going to take the one that's working which is the elephant and I'm going to first stop the run and then I'm going to go over to the elephant so all of these are now working to my knowledge so here the if not touching maze Put an and in there. If it's not touching the maze, crud, I hate it that it does that. And Let's leave like this, okay? And this has got to be a knot. That might be the problem I had with the other one. So 
So we'll put this space bar in here as our hotkey, so to speak. Okay. So there is the S. Oh, let me see that one. Okay. All right. So I'm going to use the space bar here. D change if it's touching the maze and if it's not the space bar that's doing this change it so that's D there's A there's W and there is S so let's see if the if the element still works. Okay, those all work. I don't know if the space bar is kind of funky on that or not. Let's try something other than the space bar. This is the WASD. Let's do X. Okay. File, save, run it again. Now with the X down, can I cheat? It's weird because the other one appeared to be working, except with the other one, when I go back to the monkey, those should all be knots, and I don't know if I made them all knots. Not, 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 not. So those all appear to be correct. And in the elephant, not, 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 not. All right. File. Save now. And we will come in and try to run this. The monkey can do anything it wants when I'm holding down on the when I'm holding down on the um, mouse key. <coughs> Okay, that works, that works, and that works. That's wrong.
because now they I can do anything I want to do with them. Okay, I'm already over, so I'm going to stop. Sorry about this.